can you imagine what he can do with human beings? And then he goes and makes the crowning glory of Indian cinema, Bahubali. And I remember meeting him at our humble office, and I'm saying, sir, please allow me to present your film in Hindi, because it will be my honor to show your genius to this country that needs and deserves Raja Mauli in their cinema archives. And it is actually Raja Mauli Sir's film, Bahubali, that is the first true crossover film of Indian cinema. Otherwise, we talk about crossover. Normally, when we cross, it's all over, because we cross and nothing happens. This is the first time that you talk about terms like pan-India. You talk about Indian cinema. And that is all because of this genius standing on my right. He actually, actually brought cinema together within the country, within the geographical boundaries of our great nation. He brought one cinema. Today, when I see the excitement that surrounds his film, I'm like, this is a film made by a filmmaker from the South, and it's going to probably open higher than most Hindi films have in the last two years. And I can't wait to see his magic unfold. Thank you, sir. Thank you for allowing us to just breathe the same air as you. And also, thank you for being the presentation force for Brahmasan agreeing to do this um, through Ayan's vision and magic and for all the southern markets to have your brand attached. I know, and I'm sure all of you will agree with me, will make the hugest difference. Thank you again, sir. Lots and lots of respect. One member of Brahmastra's cast actually goes way back with me and my family. I remember there was an outdoor in Seychelles, which uh, my father and mother went to. And they came back and said that we met the kindest, nicest human being on this outdoor. Him and his wife are the nicest people we've ever met. And I was very young then, and they said, Nagarjuna sir and Amla ma'am are probably the nicest people we have ever met.